I'm originally from Germany, the communist part of Germany. When the communist system collapsed, I left East Germany at the age of 19. My name is Loretta Lachs. I gave myself this name. There are many things in life that you can't change, like your sex, your age, your nationality, but you can at least change your name. My art is a personal response to the world that I have been exposed to. And I grew up in a totalitarian state, so life was very restricted there. And in a way I now enjoy the freedom to being able to express myself, which was not the case when I was a child. I trained as a painter and I continue to be influenced primarily by painting but I approach painting from a different perspective now using the camera as a tool. My technique is very complicated. It involves photography, painting and digital imagery. I always start with a mental image. So usually I have a clear idea what I want the picture to look like. I have uh, several photo sessions after which I pick the best shots and then I enhance and compose the pictures on the computer which can take up to three months for a single image. My pictures are not portraits in the traditional meaning of the word. I call them imaginary portraits because they are not about the child. As much as I love and adore them, the work is not about these children. I use them as metaphors. Metaphors for innocence and the lost paradise of childhood. Childhood cannot be repeated and that is in many ways unfortunate. It is tragic. Children are mostly beautiful but childhood is not always. I have been working on this series since the year 2000. I'm 35. I'm married without children. I don't want to talk about myself, you know. <laughs> it's always the same questions. Why don't the children smile? Why is childhood so important to me? And all that. I mean, it's, it's okay. Why should I create an answer? <laughs> <laughs>